New Zealanders spend around $120 million on vitamins every year, but according to medical researcher Dr. Sean Holt, we might as well be throwing most of that money down the toilet. He joins me now to tell me why. We do like the idea of supplementing because most of us have less, less than perfect diets. That's right. And we do like the idea of supplementing uh, our diets with vitamins. Where are we going wrong? Well, we're not going... I, I won't say most of it's being wasted. I reckon about a third of the 120 million is being wasted. And that's from taking either ones that don't work or ones that aren't appropriate for you or even the wrong dose, taking way bigger, too much a dose. So that's why I've tried to set up an organisation to solve these problems. Let's start with ones that don't work then. Are they being sold by the modern equivalent of snake oil? Merchants? Yeah, there's lots of those. I mean, we've talked about homeopathy, for example, as something that totally does not work. Um, but uh, most vitamins and supplements, I would say, actually do work if you take the right ones for your condition. So we, we need to talk broadly. What do yeah. most people need? Well, uh, I think that most doctors would agree with me. Unless you've got the perfect diet, and of course, who has that? Uh, I think everyone would benefit from a multivitamin, a good one, and a fish oil supplement. Now, you, you've you actually looked into this quite carefully. You've written a book about it. Yeah. And that, that was the genesis for your new business? It we, is. Do we do need to point out that you have a product, yep. and here it is. It's spectacularly well packaged, because this, this even has my name on it That's and right. the date yep. and all I do is rip that off and that's what I take for the day. That's right. That's and clever. It's, and it's, and uh, on the website, <laughs> on the website, you can say which medical conditions you've got. So you've got asthma, diabetes, depression, or just general health, and it'll tell you what recommendations are for you based on good research. And then you can even actually tick a button and see the research for yourself. So don't take my word for it. You can check. But the problem is people ask me all the time, Sean, I've got diabetes, I've got depression, what do I take in the natural field? Because people want to take natural things, of course mm. they do. And I just don't think there's a good source of information out there. Three quarters of people take supplements. That's right. Are they taking them for unusual things no, or no, just for, to feel better, yeah, generally? Just, you know, everyone wants to feel better, so a lot of it is general health. And again, a lot of people have specific things. They want to prevent heart disease. Uh, they want a, a natural alternative for their, uh, say, depression medications. Uh, I mean, one amazing statistic very few people know is that uh, omega-3 fish oil can work as well as Prozac for depression. What does it work on? That's your fish oil. Yeah, that's right. Mm. So um, uh, the mechanism's not clear, but, you know, very, very strong studies last year show that it can work just as well. So there's a lot of really good information and a lot of nonsense out there. The other problem as well is that you need to take things like this long term. And it's what we call in medicine compliance, so it's taking your medications, and people are terrible, actually. And you've got to make it really easy for people. Even like a one-week uh, course of antibiotics, most people wouldn't comply with. Very difficult to comply included. with. So, you know, you're taking vitamins for 20 years, you've got to make it simple. So, and many people take, like, six, seven, eight vitamins or supplements a mm. day. So imagine having eight bottles in front mm. of you too. Well, when I right. clean out my pantry, you know, I'll yeah. find bottles stacked at the back that from, you know, years ago that have expired years ago. That's right. And I can't even remember why I had them in the first <laughs> yeah. place. So that this really solves that. That's a month's supply in a yeah. box like that. Yeah. And you can deliver that to people's Yeah, we, we deliver it to the door and I say you just take the contents each day, it's personalised to you, just to make it really easy. And if you get, we've got a price comparison, if you've got about four or five or six, it's probably about half price as well, which is worth knowing So what days. does that cost me? That's, let's remind people, that's a daily multivitamin and a fish oil capsule, capsule. That particular box is not going to cost me anything, but no, what would it you. normally if that, I reorder? That would be about $30, $35, but if you had, say, six supplements in there, that might be about $70 a month which would be a bit half price from getting it from the supermarket or the pharmacy. Sounds like a good deal. Yeah. Dr Sean Holt, thanks for coming Thank in you. this morning.